Hello everyone, today I'm going to be doing a haul video and uh, it's kind of different to usual haul videos because this is a kind of collection of things that I got for my birthday because it was my birthday last week and um, I wasn't sure whether I was going to do this video because I know that some YouTubers kind of get negative feedback for doing uh, birthday or Christmas hauls um, but uh, because I love watching haul videos I thought I would do it anyway because I know it's something that um, that I like watching myself. So without further ado, I'll move on to the, the main present that I got, which was from my parents. And on the Saturday after my birthday, I went to Bista Village with my mum and my sister, and I got a handbag. And the reason I really wanted a new handbag is that um, I've been going back and forth from school carrying folders and my laptop and like loads and loads of stuff to put in a bag. And it just doesn't fit in my normal handbag. So what I really wanted was a gigantic, kind of tote to carry things around in and the bag that I ended up going for was actually the first one that I saw. Um, we, I, we walked straight into Bister and I went straight into Kate Spade and saw this and oh it's just so nice. It's got kind of gold hardware bits here, so there's the Kate Spade bit here and it's really rigid, it's not very squidgy. Uh, it's got the gold uh, studs on the bottom, the stitching is kind of cream. Inside um, I don't know if you can see inside, it's got this kind of pink and red po polka dot. I've already got a couple of things in here, but um, then it's got this uh, middle pocket here. And it's just, it's perfect size to fit my laptop in. So I adore it and love it. And I've already started kind of filling it up with things like, for example, my pencil case. Um, so yes, I'm so happy with that. And thank you, mum and dad, for, um, for getting that for me. And the next thing... I was given a Chanel lipstick from my friends Lydia and Kim and they also got me like the little sample bits um, which is good I always love the samples um, and it's this lipstick in Mademoiselle and I was so happy when I opened this because I was really um my, I, I chose this for my mum for my brother to give to my mum for Christmas and I really fell in love with the colour and it's such a classic lovely colour and it's kind of a a plum an, a nude plum I would say and I haven't used I've not used it yet so I'm not going to swatch it um I just love Chanel packaging it feels like cool it's cool to the touch the gold band here the Chanel bit at the top and it just feels so luxurious so I'm just in love with that already um yes and I got more cosmetic -y things um I got from my friend Heather sorry I'm really stiffly um, a selection of Soap and Glory things and somehow she managed to get everything that I love the best. She got me the um, Clean clean Girls body wash and I love any Soap and Glory body wash. These are just lovely and she also got me this which is Easy Glistening and I wear this anytime I have my legs out. It's kind of like um, you spray it on your legs and it's kind of like a, an oil and it smells I haven't sprayed it yet. It smells like everything Soap and Glory. It smells kind of um I can't describe it. What does soap and glory smell like? Um, but yeah, it's it's a dry it's a dry oil, sweet almond. There you go. It's a sweet almond um, scent. So it makes your legs just look really shiny, and it's kind of semi moisturising as well. It's, I wouldn't replace it as a moisturiser, but yeah, it makes your legs look really nice and shiny. Um, and then uh, she also got me the Flake Away, which is my favourite exfoliator from Soap and Glory. And yeah, so I'm just over, over the moon with that and I'll definitely get so much use out of that. I've nearly run out of my can of this and I have nearly run out of my um, shower gel, so uh, fab. Thanks, thanks Helen. I got this um, Orla Keely. Oh gosh, I don't know how to pronounce this. Orla Keely, I think it is, a little notepad from my auntie. And it's kind of a canvasy feel um, front cover and it's got the classic uh, it's got the orange down the side, but all the notes are like this. And I'm really pleased with this because I've just run out of pages in my old notebook, like literally clean run out. Whenever I've like, finished with a page in my notepad, I just tear them out. So it's like just two pieces of cardboard together now. So that couldn't have come at a better time. Um, thank you, Deb. Um, from Rob's sister, I got this organiser. And I don't have an organiser. I've um, been really wanting one for this year because... Um, next in September I'll hopefully have a job as a teacher um, so I'll really need one of these organisers so it's like um, a kind of turquoise leather I don't know if it is leather but it feels like leather um, I think it's leather 
and yeah it's just it's really nice and I love the colour so um, thank you Kit, I'm very pleased with that. While I was in Vista I went into the cosmetic outlet store and um, it's currently split into two different shops it's um, kind of moisturisers and body wash and things like and shampoos and then there's the actual makeup um, site. The makeup site was really disappointing I couldn't find anything in there that I wanted um, but I did get pick up another all about eyes um, eye cream and I'm sure that you're if you've seen my videos before I'm in love with this stuff it's so good and usually it's 24 pounds and I picked it up for 18 pounds that's so cheap like I don't know any other deal where I'd be able to pick this up for four pounds discount so even though I'm nowhere near finishing off my current pot it's always good to have a back stock of things I think um, but from oh god it's all fallen out oh no I ripped I ripped it oh no so Bob's mum bought me a selection of body shop things and she bought me a what I can only assume is body butter I've not read this yet um, I've just discovered that this is a body scrub I actually thought it was a, a body butter but it's a body scrub I've never used a body shop body butter before and I think it's a hazelnut scented one I loved the hazelnut body butter one so this is gonna be oh. <laughs> um, so that's gonna be really nice oh I'm gonna have such smooth skin after this and she bought me the some nourishing hand butter and wild rose mm, that smells good um which will be i'll keep this on my bedside table and then she also bought me the same in the um metal tube and i think these feel so luxurious i know that loctane do this do a similar metal metal tub and this will be kept in my handbag and then she bought me this really cute um really cute little wash bag thing and I think that I will fill this with cosmetics and plasters and things like that and keep that in my other handbag because the thing which is really annoying about having multiple handbags is that like when you decide to use another one you've got to like transfer everything across so um what I'd probably like to do is just get um uh, just another one of these if you want to know what I keep in my handbag I've done a what's in my bag video which I'll link below and I've got a little one of these full of uh, like paracetamols, um, essential touch-up makeup and plasters and things like that so I'll probably just make another one of those and put that in my new handbag and she also bought me these gigantic um, organic cotton pads and I cannot get enough of these things I don't have any of these massive ones so um, these are really good when I've got a full face of makeup and I just want to take it all off but from my best friend in Australia, Michaela, she bought me this she, Michaela always buys the best presents um, and if you're watching, I miss you and I love you. Um, she bought me this gorgeous bikini from Insight. And she said that she's bought the same one in like the inverse colours. So I think it's so pretty. I'm not going to try this on because that would be highly inappropriate. Um, so yes, and it's got the um, embroidered bit on the back and a kind of metal tag on the front. So these are just gorgeous. Thank you very much. Mickey, um, this necklace that I got from my friend, my dear friend Hannah, and Hannah and I, I think, have been friends for about 20 years now, so I hope that doesn't reveal too much about my age. Um, actually, I think I've got my age up somewhere on my site, but uh, she bought me this gorgeous gold necklace, which would actually go really well with my outfit today, and it's a kind of very delicate skeleton gold leaf um, and when I opened it, I said, oh, how did you know? Because um, I only wear gold jewellery. And she said, oh, I just like, I picked it, picked up on it. Um, so she remembered and that's like, means heaps to me. And I think it's so pretty. Um, from my granny, I got this really cute kind of art deco style um, mini frame. And um, I'm not sure what photo I'll put in here. I'll have to have a look through ones that I have of my granny and I. Um, I'm actually going to see my granny today. So, um, Maybe I'll take a couple of photos of us and kind of keep it in here. Oh, the last thing that I'm going to talk about is what Rob got me. And he is taking me away to Wales um, after I finish my teaching placement. So uh, potentially, because that will be a kind of holiday, I might vlog that. And if you're interested in seeing a vlog of Rob and I going away to Wales, might bring the dog. That might be chaos. So, you know, who knows? But if you're interested in vlogging, because uh, that's something I'd be interested in doing. I'm going sailing um, as well as soon as I finish my placement. So um, obviously I can't do those two things at the same time. But if you'd be interested in seeing some vlogs of me sailing and going to Wales with Rob and Dog, then let me know because um, I'd love to do them. And if I won't do them unless you'd be interested. Could I ramble any more? Um, but yes, that, that's the end of my birthday haul. I hope you enjoyed it. You won't get another one of these for another year because that's the way birthdays go. Um, I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.